Hello and welcome to the Cryptocurrency News Channel. Want to join my live stream? Check out the links in the description and in the comments below. So let's actually get started on um, how do you find good buy and sell points and how do you actually pick out gems and also how do you pick out times to buy coins? Um, how do you keep up with all the information? So to pick out the right times to actually buy gems or good crypto uh, buy in points or buy in dates, there are a couple of tools that you should use. One is Coin Market Cal. Someone, uh, one of one of my friends, or one of my Twitter friends, actually uh, reminded me of this. I've used it before, but they reminded me of this uh, site, and it's a, a very good tool. You also need to read the Coinbase and Binance blogs, and you also need Twitter, um, Telegram, and also Reddit. But let's actually go over this first. When you first get to the site, it's a, this site basically um, lists all the upcoming information for every coin they can actually find. Right now it is about June 4th, and they go all the way out to like June 30th. Obviously they can't cover every event, and the closer you actually get to today, the more um, in depth the events will be. Obviously they don't have every event from like 20 days out, but you know, they have, as you get closer, you have more and more events actually coming up. And you should look at like what the significant ones are. Like there's a Telegram AMA on June 8th. Telegram is no longer investable, so that's probably not important. There's a Tron project announcement on June 8th. We don't really know what that is, but that could be significant. A ProBit listing uh, on June on June 8th, and a new controversial new website or something on June 5th. So if you really look at this, we, you know you're, there's, you know, there's a Binance AMA uh, for tomorrow. There's a Zoom AMA for some of it tomorrow. There's a, like a Horizon Weekly Insider 43 coming out. So they actually cover all this stuff. Um, on. And if you're interested in Cody, they're actually going to be staking on Pool X uh, starting uh, basically in a few hours. Basically, Elrond is also going to have their stress test tomorrow. So, and also like you know, Insolar is going to have Pool X staking. Knowles is going to have a Decoin listing. That's probably not all that significant because it's a fairly small exchange. Dash has an AMA. So like, if you want to know when your favorite coins are going to have an AMA, that you do have a schedule on this. Like Digibyte has an AMA on June 6th. So this tool, this site is actually a must if you want to look at really, really good. Um, this site is a must if you want to find really, really good buy-in points based on news because this site has a lot of news. And there might be tidbits here that people don't know about uh, that you might actually find out before the rest of the group. And that could be critical in making money. The second thing is obviously keep track of Binance or have alerts for Binance and Coinbase blogs. Binance.us and Coinbase blogs. Um, if they actually support staking for a coin, that coin does usually go up in price. Sometimes listings also make a coin go up in price. So you want to keep an eye out on those blogs. Third, you actually want to follow um, your favorite coins, Twitter, or a lot of coins, Twitters, and actually get notifications on a lot of announcements. Because um, many coins, the first place they'll actually turn is their social media on Twitter to notify people of certain events coming up like I get a lot of my VeChain information via Twitter and I can get that information via Twitter um, sooner than I can actually then actually then the news channels actually update the announcements so Twitter might give you an edge too. just if you follow the uh, if you follow your favorite cryptos Twitter page the other thing is the reddit the subreddits of your favorite Twitter now this is kind of dangerous because there's just so much speculation in the subreddits and you have to be able to sift fact from fiction obviously there's a lot of speculation and there's like a lot of uh, rumors and stuff going on, but you know, like they'll, a lot of times they'll actually tell you when important people are tweeting stuff out or um, when like companies actually are in the works making kind of announcements. I've actually gotten a lot of my ADA and VeChain information as well as other coin information from their subreddits. And it's actually been a valuable source of information for me to share with other people. I can sometimes get it before it actually um, wi uh, gets widespread, although not always. The next thing is Telegram. There's a lot of crap on Telegram, so you got to be careful of that. But a lot of the people on Telegram do like sniff out news, and though and you might get some tidbits, maybe a couple of hours even before everyone else does, and that could be crucial crucial in your trading and uh, making money. So that's kind of how you find the good times to buy those gem coins. Check out the four resources I just mentioned. I think if you like do an extensive research based on those four, you can actually do significantly better in your crypto world. Then if you don't, now, I know it takes a lot of work, but you know what? Making money does take a lot of work. So that is the news for today. Let me know what you think. Like and subscribe. Hit that bell notifications button. Thank you and have a nice day.